Hey guys, Lost Wolf here, and welcome to Natural Selection 2 Terminal Velocity Facepalm Achievement. Alright, so in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to get the achievement. So it's Terminal Velocity Facepalm for when a regular facepalm doesn't cut it. Alright, so since the new update of Update 296 release, uh, it came out with a couple of new achievements, such as completing the Marine tutorial, completing the Alien tutorial, and two Easter Egg achievements, which is Darwin Award on the Alien side, and also the Terminal Velocity Face Palm achievement, which I am going to show you how to get in this video. And it's going to be in the Marine tutorial. So let's uh, check out the new Marine tutorial. So what I like, what I like about the new tutorials is that they have awesome, uh, engaging voice acting and dialogue that the narrator will tell you what to do and stuff. But I'll let I'll let it show you by itself. I'll let it speak speak for itself. So let's uh let's do it. Welcome to the Marine team, soldier. As a Marine, your primary concern is to protect this structure, the command station. The Marine commander sits inside this structure, coordinating the team from an eagle eye view. And this is an infantry portal. This is where Marines are 3D printed back into existence. Without these vitally important structures, your team cannot respawn. Marines spawn with a rifle, a pistol, and an axe. Try switching to them now. Alright, before I start doing the tutorial, I just want to let you guys know that that was that awesome voice acting that I was uh, talking about. And also, uh, you do not need to complete the tutorial to get that achievement. It's very early on in the beginning. Uh, I had to figure it out. It took me a while. I had to do various stuff that you normally wouldn't do in a tutorial. And uh, you just get it. Alright, so let's, uh, let's move on. The commander has dropped an armory blueprint. The commander can place buildings, but they require ground troops like you to actually Objective build the structure. Completed. Approach the blueprint and build the armory with your use key. Good. Now you have a place to heal as well as buy any new weapons that the commander unlocks. One of our base structures needs repairing. Buy a welder from the armory. Alright. And this will also give you a taste of the tutorial. So even if you're a new player that just stumbled across National Selection, I think this tutorial is great for you guys. And if you're a veteran that's been playing National Selection 2 for many, many years, I urge you to uh, complete the tutorial so you see if you can find the Easter egg, because it's still pretty worth going back to your roots and learning the basics. Alright, so let's uh, buy the welder. Now you can repair the observatory. The observatory is a valuable structure that allows you to detect enemies through walls in a large radius. Good work. The commander would like to unlock more weapons for the team, but needs more resources to do so. To get resources faster, we need more resource extractors. But extractors can only be built on resource nodes, and this room only has the one. We will build our second extractor in Cafeteria. Open your map to find Cafeteria. The map is an invaluable tool for both Marines and Aliens. Refer to it often. Make your way to Cafeteria now. Proceed to Waypoint. Alright. You've just oh. been parasited. Notice the yellow icon in the corner and the bugs crawling over your weapon. Every alien in the game can now see exactly where you are, even through walls. Unfortunately, there's no way to get rid of a parasite except to simply wait it out. The commander has scanned the area. There's the alien that parasited you. Kill it. Proceed to waypoint. You jerky alien, how dare you parasite me? Good work, Objective you've completed. been injured. Request a med pack from the commander to heal yourself. There, you've been healed, and the commander spent one resource to do so. You can also request an ammo pack to resupply yourself. Do this now. Commander, I need ammo. Good. The commander spent another resource to give you that ammo. Now go secure the resource node in cafeteria to ensure they can afford to continue to support you. Proceed to waypoint. Alright, so instead of heading next to the waypoint, what we're gonna do is take a little dive over here. So let's uh, let's do it. Woo! Sorry, you're not getting away that easily. Oh, watch me. So you get to be defiant. Stop it. <laughs> we cut it out. All right. Are you really that desperate to get out of doing the tutorial? 
Yes. With all the time you've wasted, you could have just done the darn thing by now. Nope. If you keep trying to kill yourself, we won't let you play in S3. Ooh, is that a hint that it's going to be an upcoming National Section 3? I'm warning you. Oh, you already warned me already. I'm just going to keep doing it. Hooah! All right, that's it. We've made note of your Steam ID, and we're not letting you play NS3. Ever. Oh. But but I want to play NS3. It's a shame, too. Hypothetically speaking, if there were an NS3, and we were already heavily into development on it, it would be looking pretty amazing. <laughs> all the new alien life forms are incredible, and all the new marine weapons are amazing. Now I'm just letting my imagination run, run wild. I could imagine a lot of new things about NS3, if they ever did make it. Uh, we've even added in a third playable team. Uh, hypothetically speaking, of course. <laughs> Unless they're talking about Subnautica. Too bad you won't ever be able to see it. Oh, you're such a jerk. I'm just going to keep jumping down then. Yep, too bad. Man. Just let me face plant the ground. Why are you still doing this? Because <laughs> it's funny watching your reaction. Why? <laughs> no reason. I just want to. Seriously, the novelty of this is wearing off real fast. You know what you have to give me for me to stop doing it. Are you really that bored? <laughs> yep. What is it you want exactly? <laughs> If I give you an achievement, will you go away? Maybe. There. There's your damned achievement. Leave me alone. <laughs> there you go. Terminal velocity face pump. Unlock on the top right. So if I were to refresh this. There you go. And there's also a hidden achievement, which I do not know how to get yet. But if I do, I'll make a video about that. And let's see if he says anything else after jumping off here. Seriously, that's all there is here. You can stop now. <laughs> All right, I um, I won't keep you. Uh, bye, I guess. <laughs> I haven't exhausted all your dialogue yet. Ah, so I never get get to face palm myself on the ground. What a bummer! All right, so I guess that that's about it, and I think the tutorial will continue as planned if you head on. There's a gorge tunnel here, and it's open. Aliens will use this structure to bring in reinforcements. Destroy it quickly. All right, I guess that, I guess that's about it. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and that's how you get the achievement. So, yeah, that's about it. So I urge you guys to check out the full marine tutorial and alien tutorial if you guys haven't already. It's it's simply amazing to find these hidden Easter eggs from the Natural Selection Two team. So yeah, so I just want to say thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you guys on the next epic Lost Wolf production. I'm Lost Wolf, and I'm signing off.